Hi friends, this is Jay Eichmann, YouTube channel Road Test Success, and we have a very unique video today to share. This is actually an official driving test pretest by a, an official state examiner. So what's going to make this video extremely valuable is that you're going to get a glimpse into the mind and rationale of the examiner because she will be guiding guiding the student through a pretest. This test this pretest is right before the student takes their actual test and it's an option you can pay extra for. So listen closely to what the examiner is emphasizing in this test because it is a great reminder for the things that you should be doing and paying close attention to right, while son. you do your driving test. All right, now I'm going to go through some instructions with you, but it's not going to be anything that you have never, ever heard before, probably over and over and over since you took driver's ed with us. Okay? Just play like it's a drive time, don't be. Especially right now, it's just a practice drive. And I'm going to talk to you, and I'm going to tell you what I'm looking for, and all that kind of stuff. Okay. All right. I'm going to go ahead and go through this now, and I won't do it in a minute. Okay. I'm going to be watching how you control the car. You make it do what you want it to do. Okay. That includes your speed. Do not drive either too fast or too slow, or it will count against you. Okay. Now, we're not going out on, on Greenville. We'll be going out on McDermott over there, and yes, that sign is posted. So I won't tell you what it is. Okay? You know where to find your speed limit signs, right? Right after an intersection, right? Okay? I'm going to be watching your observation skills throughout the drive. I must see you look in your mirrors often, and anytime we pass cross streets. Okay? There's plenty of cross streets as we're going straight down the road and in the neighborhoods, right? So. Um, and also, when you make your turns, if I've asked you to turn right, I need to see you look left before you turn right and vice versa, right? Okay? If your head is not turning in these locations, you're not looking according to the test. I am sure that those instructors drilled it in your head. Move the head, right? Okay, I'm going to be watching the position of your car as you drive forward, where you stop, and as you make your turns. Okay, uh, you must use your signal throughout the test. And last but not least, you cannot do anything dangerous or illegal on this test. Okay, okay. <laughs> you got that down? All right. I think it would be easier for us to back out and drive that way, and I'm going to go back behind the building this way. Before starting, what's the, uh, like the threshold for, I guess, what speed I should be at? Like, is it not, you know, like, like three under? Three to five under. Okay, so if your speed limit is 40, you might keep it about 35 or so. If the speed limit in the neighborhood is 30, you might keep it at 25. That way, I am absolutely positive you did not pop that speed limit because you will fail if you pop it. How slow is Anything under 10. Okay. So if the speed limit is 40, you can't go 29. You can go 30, and I won't. I won't ding you. But if you go 29, then I got you. Right. It's 10 under. Okay, nothing over. Right. Okay, anything else? Uh, well, it's a practice test. You can ask me all you want on this first one, right? right. All right, let's back out this way and drive that way. Right. Okay. Signal. You're backing this way. Okay. Now then, look around. Okay. Now back out. So we're starting the examination, and you, you've already heard a lot of the tips from the examiner, and if you picked up on it, the biggest thing she was highlighting was this idea of keeping your head moving, being aware, checking your mirrors frequently. We've got a rear view mirror camera on this test, and you should practice scanning that mirror. Also practice scanning left and right. And just like the examiner had said, if your head's not moving, you're not looking. So you may say, well, I looked, but if they don't actually see those head movements, there's going to be deductions. Show awareness, scan your mirrors, and be alert. You know, there's so many things you need to know about the driving and driving test. Turned right, right there, or left, go there. 
so many things to know about driving and the test in general. They can't cover all of it in your lessons. That's why I'm excited to share this partnership that I have. We've got a number one best-selling book on Amazon, and I've linked it up there in the banner. Take a look at it. One of the best things about it is that is that it can be free. The digital copy copy can be free for you with a subscription to Audible. So check out our driving book linked up above and in the info below the video. Oh yes. Complete. No California roads allowed on the DPS test. No, when it rocks back. That's all you have to do. Go around the edge of this building this way. I will do the start part of the test where we just did it and then I won't do anything else with the test until we're back out on the road again. So this alley and everything's not going to count on your test. Mm -hmm. All right. I want you to go down to that second out. Okay. Not this one. Go down one more. That's going to make it easier for you to get in the left lane. Okay. Go down that way a little bit. I'll show it to you. All right. So we're getting ready to enter the roadway and begin the official road portion of this pretest. Right. I want to take a moment to thank this student for their willingness to share this exam. This is what makes this channel work. Viewers like you sharing their exam and we do reward you for that. So if you're interested in sharing your exam, we have a dash cam reimbursement program. We will pay for your dash camera. And we also include an additional $100 bonus for exceptionally unique content. So take a look at the banner above and in the description below to learn about our dash cam reimbursement program where you can get yourself a free dash camera for your willingness to share. So you don't have time to get there right away. Okay, go up here, stop to where you can see his tires touch. Now that when that light turns green, Okay, as we approach it, I need to see you look back at this side of the street before you make your turn left into left, right? Okay. Nothing new, right? Okay, so as you pull toward it, okay, let your head move and look over here. Make your turn left into left, but you have to look before you make your turn, right? Make sure nobody's coming at you. All right. When it's safe, make a lane change to the right. There you go. You only have to check it once. All right. Make a lane change to the left. Near, near, blind spot. Slide over. There you go. Next street, turn left. Right here. As we were driving down that street, I don't believe I seen you look in your rear view mirror one time. Okay. All right. I need to see you at least once. Okay. Make your turn. Yep. <laughs> Speed limit in the neighborhood is 30. Okay, search that intersection. Let your head turn. Make your next left. Turn left. Okay, did you look back to the right before you turn? You can go 25. 
bunch of crazy people here. I don't see anybody. It'd be a shame to mess up this car. Not only that, it'd probably piss Daddy off. <laughs> you know? Alright, go to this stop sign and go straight. Okay. Alright, and let it rock back. That's your stop. There you go forward. this stop sign and take a right. to the next stop sign. Did you look at that intersection? Uh, we'll go up that stop sign and take a right. These cars will be gone next time we come around. Yeah, they clear out about 420 or so. Alright, just run on down the middle of the street at about 25. Okay, you can pull back over, it'll be on your side of the street. Go up here to the stop sign and take a right. Okay, it's your turn. This car won't be so busy in a minute. intersection. Go forward. There you go. sign and take a right.
job. Watch the idiots. Don't stop. You got right away. Go to the light and make a right. Is your signal on? Yeah, I think so. Because that's the next thing I want Turn right. You should look left. Make your turn. Go up here just a little way. See where that white van's turning into that alley? I want you to turn in there and go that way. Is somebody actually trying to parallel park backwards? They really are. Look at that. <laughs> Alright, go parallel park. He did exactly that. His back tires were up against the curb here and he was facing the building. <laughs> I looked at him and I said, really? <laughs> Parallel park. Right. Don't forget your observation. Check. Check your blind spot. Okay, now then you can back up. Turn it. your camera. You're going too far. You went way too far. Go the other way. But yeah, you went way too far. Hang on, hang on. Come on. Come on, lady. Let's let this clear out. You pull out of here. We're going to practice this. Pull out. Yeah, pull out and get straight here. Straight here. Okay, now stop. Now back up past that cone. Straight. Back up. Back up straight. we got to reline back up to that cone. Leave your wheel straight. Back up. Go back, 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 back. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Straight, straight, straight. Straight, straight, straight. All right, I want you to stop and pull up within two feet of that cone right there. Then I want you to line that cone up with the middle of your back tire. Do you know where that's at on the car? Okay, then let's do that. Okay, get within two feet of the car or that cone. Okay? That looks good. Now straight in. Okay. Line that pole up with the middle of your back tire. Straight in. Got it? Signal you're going to park. Put it in reverse. Okay. All the way around. Mirror blind spot. Now back it up. Don't let that steering wheel move until I tell you. Okay, we're going to go back to a 45 degree angle. It should come in about right in here. Stop. Take your steering wheel and go the other way. Beautiful. Okay, roll it in. Just let it roll back. Come on. It's perfect. Let go. Come on, you got plenty of room out there. All right. Now then, stop your car, put it in drive. 
Okay, take your steering wheel, go one, two, three, and pull that front end in parallel to that curb. That looks good, doesn't it? Put it in park. Let me out. No. Ta da! Looks good. That's how you parallel park. All right. All right. Let's get out of here. Let's exit to the left. Put it in reverse and reverse a little bit so you can get out and not hit that cone, right? So back it up. It's still hotter than you, isn't it? But you've got some room. Okay. All right. I think you can get out. Signal you're going to leave. Put it in drive. Okay, take your steering wheel and go all the way that way. Mirror blind spot. Make sure nobody's coming at you. Okay, pull it out and go around the corner of that building. All right, get out there a little ways. Get your wheel straight and stop. Yeah, right now, stop. Do your straight back up. That a boy. Now then, since you do have a camera, look backwards. When this car starts moving, let it start moving. Look backwards. Let it start moving. Now you can look at your camera. Okay? Stop. All right, that's the end of this test. Okay, into your practice test, right? Mm -hmm. Let's see. Let's circle this little parking place and come back out here and go back around the building and we'll go out and get started. So the student went on to take their official exam with the same examiner immediately following this pretest. And they did great. They checked their mirrors, checked their blind spots, moved their head at intersections, scanning. There was only one de deduction on the official test that followed this, and that was being a little bit far away from the curb during the parallel park. We've got tons of other videos on the channel that are going to help prepare you for your test. Be sure to check out our Amazon book and consider contributing your own video.